uh hi guys i welcome all uh, all of you in this video and in this video we are going to learn about the uh, rapid spanning tree protocol so basically we talk about the rapid spanning tree protocol it is a you know uh, the ad the advantage of using the rapid spanning tree protocol is like uh, uh rstp we call it as a short form so rstp significantly reduce the time to conversions the active topology of the network when changes to the physical topology or its configuration parameter so for, suppose we have a uh, topology here something like that and if any change happens to here uh, it 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 will replicate as uh, immediately uh, uh, entire the uh, through network and it reduces the time for the for this process the next thing about this uh, rapid spanning tree protocol is uh, rstp defines the additional port role of additional uh, alternate and backup and it defines port status discarding learning or forwarding so this is the second uh, advantage of using the rapid spanning tree protocol and the next thing is uh, rstp selects one switch as the root of a spanning tree active topology and assign port roles to individual ports of the switch depending on uh, whether the ports are part of the active topology the next thing about is uh, uh, our stp is it provides the rapid connectivity uh, following the failure of the switch if there is a failure of the switch it provides uh, rapid connectivity immediately uh, uh on on the failure of switch or a switch port or a lan and the next thing a new root port and the designated port of the other side of the bridge transition of forwarding through the split hand sec uh, between them so the uses a uh, uh, concept of hand sec between the uh, switches on the network and rstp allows switch port configuration so that uh the port can transition of forwarding directly when the switch reinitializes and as you can see here we have three switches one is a root bridge and one is uh, uh we have not taken uh, the switch uh, like uh, root bridge but we have taken uh, this one switch jet as a root bridge switch so if we talk about this switch we have two ports here a designated port and the next uh uh if we talk about this switch so this port is uh, taken as a root port because uh from here only the uh, the traffic is going to reach to root root bridge and same thing is here uh if you see uh, this is the root port for this switch because this is the shortest cost you can say and uh, uh, yes we call it cost uh this uh, distance Uh, between the shortest distance between the uh, root bridge and the source bridge you can say or uh, the design i mean from where you want to reach to root bridge and every uh, uh, this thing if we talk about this x uh, switch and y switch we have one designated port here but in this network one port will be uh, remain as a alternate port or backup port so this port will be considered as alternate port now we will see uh, rstp port roles what are the roles of all the ports if we talk about the root so if it is a root port then what will what will happen root a forwarding port elected for the spanning tree topology see if it is a root port then it will be selected as elected for the spanning tree topology and it will remain as a forwarding next designated a forwarding port elected for every switch switch lan segment if we have lan segment then there will be one designated port also the next thing alternate an alternate path to the bridge that is different from the path that the root port takes example uh this is the alternate path because uh data from this switch can reach to this root or root bridge from this path as well as this this path but it is going through this path because it is it is taking uh, more cost so this is your alternate port backup a backup path that provides a redundant but less desirable connection to a segment to switch another switch port already connect backup ports can exist only where two ports are connected together in a loop back by point to point link or bridge with two or more connections to a shared lan 
and if we talk about the desire de uh, disabled uh, a port that has no role within the operation of a spanning tree so this is how we have uh, uh, rstp works and i hope this video will be informative you uh, for you guys for more videos you can uh, subscribe my channel and the url of my channel is here from there you can see or learn uh, the windows server videos also i hope this will be, uh, video will be informative uh, for you